welcome back to the YouTube channel. Today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you my favorite pieces on Caramelin at the moment because there is a 30% off discount code and I thought you guys could make the most of it. If you want to watch back from my other hauls, there is a lot of Caramelin inspiration on those. It's one of my favorite brands. So let's get into the first piece. So Caramelin brought out, I'm such a lover of an off the shoulder. And I'll tell you this, I know it's so awkward to wear with a bra, but you definitely can wear like underneath this one, I've worn a really tight swimsuit kind of one shoulder to keep the boobs in. I know I've not got boobs enough to like worry about them jiggling around. So I don't know, but I just love an asymmetrical neckline because it is so, so flattering. If it creates a sh womanly, fig like it creates a womanly shape, like if you wore a straight up, straight down outfit, it will show every lump and bump. Something about asymmetry in an outfit is so flattering. It's very like forgiving on the figure. It just creates a beautiful shape. That is one of the reasons why I like it. So if you can, if you've got big boobs and you're figuring out how can I wear this, definitely look into like a swimsuit, like a really tight swimsuit, just to wear underneath stuff. That would be my suggestion, or like a one strap bra would do. Um, but it's one of my favorite styles, so if you're anything like me, you will live in asymmetrical tops. It's something very designer-esque, like it looks just off the runway. Love a collarbone, think it's so sexy. The One of the things I always say, isn't it? But this is a black off the shoulder top. It is designed to go off the shoulder, so one sleeve goes down. I love it, this is me to a T. Paired with my good old gorgeous pencil skirt. This has been one I've worn, like go to a lot in my wardrobe. I have it in cream as well. It's just such a beautiful, like figure hugging, beautiful pencil skirt. This is a cream one paired with the brown version of the top for a more spring summer palette. Um, I'm not sure this tan color is my vibe. I think it, I need to her fake tan and not fake tan today so that I'm looking extra pink but if you've got a gorgeous tan this beautiful bronze color would look beautiful on it paired with brown accessories even with little sandals in the like flat sandals in the summer such a gorgeous very womanly sexy kind of outfit and if you wanted to be a big statement let's go orange you know I love the color orange. It's such a vivid, bright color. And paired with the black, it's very, very striking. This reminds me of a bit more of a bougie vibe, which, you know, I love. So here are some different color palettes for you to play with. I love the off the shoulder knit that Caramelin's thrown out here. <laughs> guys loved it over on Instagram and I have to say like the shape of it there's something about the faux leather vibe it's just really really striking isn't it it comes in two colorways the pink and the black I have them both the thick I love a skirt with a really thick waistband because it kind of like cinches you in around the waist and then goes into this really gorgeous pencil maxi skirt who knew that pencil maxi skirts were so sexy but I feel like they're really really sexy one of the things I do love this time of year as well I think in spring, before you get right into summer, it's a really great way to wear knitwear, but like thin knitwear, like sleeveless knits or off the shoulder knits. So that's the, that's the vibe this time of year. This sleeveless, I love an arm. I, th I think an arm is really sexy. <laughs> Is it just me? Like a strong arm. So I, you'll see me wear a lot of these like sleeveless roll necks. I think it's a really strong vibe. So this was a real winner for me, both both colorways. I've paired the nudie pink one with, it, it's a swimsuit found on Caramel. I think it's a swimsuit. It feels like a swimsuit, but I love the gold chain detailing at the top. I don't know if you want to see. Just, I've gone for the asymmetry again. It's just a really cool vibe, I find. Okay, this dress. I had to pick it up. The ballerina and me loves these kind of outfits and the colors and the floral pattern in this, it is beautiful. Like how striking, 
this is a great color for like a wedding because it's so bright and colorful the races all your occasion wear goodness this dress is the one i love how it makes your waist look teeny tiny you literally would look like a fairy on top of a cake with this and i'm here for it like it's not a bad vibe for me i love that <laughs> sometimes being dainty and feminine over like sexy and strong is a good thing. I like it. For those spring occasions, definitely a winner for me. So this is a great example here of how Karen Millen does different colorways. So this is the black version of the outfit. They do these really cool t-shirts. This t-shirt, it's a body, but oh my God, it's tight. <laughs> so maybe size up. I was like, I find it really hard to get on. Um, yeah, so just be aware of that. I have paired it here with this skirt. This skirt is such a thick fabric. Like it's well, so well made. Like I really feel like Caramel has really upped the quality of her clothes recently. Like they really are worthwhile investing in because they are beautifully made. I love the asymmetry of the skirt, like the little buckle detail going down slightly. It's like a wraparound feel. Just really gorgeous, right to the floor. I'm five foot four for reference, so if you wanna gauge the length of things. And I have the different colors. So this is the tan version with the white top and just going into spring, summer, maybe like the tan, the lighter color palette is more of an option, but I don't know, I really enjoy wearing black throughout the year. It's my favorite color. <laughs> March, April is rain, rain, rain in England. So in March and April, we definitely have that rainy season where my go-to coat of choice is usually a trench coat because it's not that, it's not swamping you, swamping you, warm. <laughs> it's not swamping you with warm, like it's not too warm, oh God. So my go-to choice of coat is usually a trench coat because it's not too warm, it's not too overbearing, but you still get to like keep your outfit off the, from the rain. So this trench coat, what I loved about it is the black button detailed on the sleeves. It was really striking. I love, you probably guessed, I love like popping the collar on a trench coat. I think there's something so cool about it. Nipping the waist, like the long line of it, it's a really great vibe. So I've just paired this with some black accessories and a black underlayer, but this is like a really cool overcoat just to like spice up an outfit. So one of the biggest trends of spring 2023 is the maxi skirt and I am here for it. I think there's something very elegant, very strong, very powerful about a maxi skirt. So this is a beautiful white one. I have paired it with this white draping kind of high neck top and I think this, I, I'm so in love with this kind of smart wear like beautiful put together like even with a pair of trainers or ballet flats this is probably my spring style to a tee these kind of long skirts with a little top i love it blazer over the top if it's a little bit chilly as we get into the warmer months please england send us some sunshine <laughs> we've had like the most miserable march but i'm 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 hoping for sunshine soon hey April, you're gonna be a heat wave i can sense it but this is a beautiful beautiful pair even for work or meetings if your office is a little laid back all these styles work so so well so this is an all brown outfit i love the monochromatic look here definitely a beautiful striking outfit to wear all one color the quality of this skirt is super good like the, it's heavy it falls nicely there's no creasing whatsoever and the fact that it's pleated makes it a little bit easier not to crease either um so definitely a good quality skirt i think caramel do it in a few different colors i think i have the tan version the great thing about caramel they usually do curve they do petite they do size four, the, the size range is big the colorway is strong and it's definitely a place where I think is really easy to shop. Definitely for like a smart wear occasion, I'd love for them to throw in some more casual vibes. That would be amazing, like some basics. Um, I think that's something I'd really look love on Karen Millen because they do smart wear very, very well, which definitely fits in with my style. But um, yeah, I'd love to incorporate, lo love to see them incorporate more casual wear. I'm really into the faux leather at the moment, aren't I? This dress is like a power, outfit imagine rocking up to your casual meet and like meaning business in this i don't know if you work if you work in offices that allow this kind of thing but i wish i did <laughs> i would like just feel like i'm owning it like i've put this does come with a belt two belts actually it's actually really nice but i just switched it out because i really wanted to cinch in the waist and um, the belts from all saints but um you could put any belt with it i i do tend to like switch out belts i feel like it's a 
kind of a vibe of mine. But the collar, the faux leather, the cinched and waist and the length skirt, this is talking to me on so many different levels. I think they did a sage green version as well, which is kind of cool for spring. So this one was kind of cool. There was a dress version of this, which I think I might have preferred. But I love like the stripes. Kind of looks like you're naked, but kind of not. I, I kind of dig it. <laughs> <laughs> kind of really into it um but yeah i love how it draws your eye to like round and um, think there's something really sexy about that there's a vibe here there is a real vibe when i shop on Karen Miller, isn't there i um, paired with the black pencil skirt but as i said the dress version i feel like is more of a vibe they had like a bright colored one just love the stripes of it. I feel like that was something really different. So this is a, a tan version of the bodysuit I was talking about before with a white um, crop jacket over the top. The pants are from Revolve, so not Caramelin, but I do have uh, they do have similar on Caramelin, I think. Um, but this, I love like the little cropped blazer over this jacket. I thought that was a really cool kind of look for spring, summer, spring, not quite something yet, are we? <laughs> but even with like a little pair of shorts, like I, I, find, I think a blazer like this would be really handy as it goes warmer. I really try and do, because I've got such a global audience and if I stuck to England being rainy and cold, I like isolate all you guys that live in all the glorious climate. So if you're living in England and think, why is she dressing for the summer? It's because most of my audience live around the world. So I kind of have to try and do a lot for everyone. Karen Millen ships globally now as well, I think. Do quote me if I'm wrong, do correct me if I'm wrong. But I think you can, I think you can shop all over the world. So guys, that is everything today. I hope you liked the pieces I picked out. Don't forget you can use this code if you're watching it around the date that it goes live and this code for 20% off if you're watching it whenever check in the description box but if you're new here please stick around press subscribe i'd love for you to join the family and i will see you next time for another video